good news. The check cleared. It's go time. Throwing frag! Throwing grenade! We've taken control. What is up YouTube? It's Chase here. Hero X Cable X back again. And what I wanted to talk to you today about is the state of Call of Duty and how it is evolved in the YouTube community and how it's basically a juggernaut. Um, I found that it is extreme that it is extremely difficult for new YouTube I guess channels to actually get noticed unless they have Call of Duty gameplay. Now me personally, my channel has recently grown since I've played uh, since I posted some Black Ops 2 gameplay. I actually got a good amount of subs off of it and some pretty active subs as well. So maybe YouTube is Call of Duty and Call of Duty is YouTube. I don't I don't know. What I'm seeing is a trend that um all these I guess Call of Duty commentators are actually gaining a lot of speed and a lot of ground just because they post Call of Duty stuff. Now me personally being a fighter, I normally play fighting games if you've seen my channel. And uh, if you're new to this channel, I will continue to post Black Ops 2 because hey, it helps my channel out and you know the game's not that terrible. But anyways, Call of Duty is just this juggernaut in the, in the community I've seen. I mean, every, my entire sub box is like literally filled up of Call of Duty stuff for some reason. Although I do follow some um, some fighters as uh, Maximilian, Filipino Champ, and well, Fil Filipino Champ doesn't post anything, but uh, J.R. Rodriguez posts stuff on, on behalf of him. But um, I do follow my fighters, but... Man, it seems like my entire sub box is full of uh, Call of Duty stuff. And the gamer YouTube community, that's the only thing that seems to be getting views. I've, e I've even tried posting like new er, newer games as in a DMC. I had a, had a little bit of fall through with that because I kept on getting copyright notices. So I had to actually take down a few of my episodes and... No, it just wasn't growing my channel like I wanted to, so I didn't. I wasn't able to finish it. But for some reason, people love Call of Duty, man. They love to, even when the game's broken as can be, they love complaining about it, and they love, you know, love watching it. I guess they. If you come for the gameplay, the beast gameplay, you're at the wrong spot. I have pretty good commentary. You know, I, I, I can talk. I have a really sexy voice, I think. <laughs> but yeah, so this juggernaut that is Black Ops 2 just... I can't wrap my brain around it. Because maybe I'm not a first-person shooter person first off. But, you know, it's fun. And if my subscribers enjoy it, hey, I'll throw a couple videos down on it. So, anyways, in this gameplay... I, I actually do kind of good. I don't do terrible. I end up getting a few lightning strikes, I think, and um, I go go a little beast towards the end. So I'm still working on it. I I don't know exactly what to run. I, right now I have the Type 90. I'm running the Type 95, which is working out fairly decent for me. You know, I'm doing pretty well with it, but that's the only gun that I've actually. Well, you start with it unlocked, but that's the only gun that I've actually been able to use. Try to use the uh, the FI FAL, but um, that didn't work out because I just nerfed it, and it just takes way too way too long for me to actually learn how to shoot the gun because you have to. It's like a one shot, but it's whatever, and I don't have the patience to actually go and get the rapid fire. You know, level up the uh, the gun to get the rapid fire. Um, recently I've been playing and I unlocked the Bouncing Betty and man, that is fun to use, I swear. I, I, I can just throw it in random spots and people are like, oh look, Bouncing Betty, let's walk over it. You know, I've been, I got a pretty good kills off of that, so I've actually gone away from the lethal, um, lethal frag grenade and decided to go with the Bouncing Bettys and, you know, it works out fairly decent for me. 
I can uh, at least have my back um, my back covered whenever I need to. You know, if I'm if I'm running into a, into a room, I can always throw my bouncing Betty into um, into the hallway and uh, just wait it out, see if there's anybody coming, and if there is, then. They'll, uh, they'll get picked up unless they have the flag jacket, which I haven't, uh, unlocked yet. You know, I've been, uh, working on it a little bit, but haven't, haven't really played too much. Haven't put too much time into it. Haven't prestiged at all, so. I don't even know if I will prestige. Anybody? I really don't care to prestige. If I get my guns, then I'm probably gonna stay with it. It's not that big of a deal for me to prestige. But yeah, anyways, this has been Hero X Cable X signing out. I'm gonna leave you with a little bit of uh, music like I did last time. But lead. thanks for watching, folks. Peace. <laughs>